All right, welcome back to another part of the quarry. Your mum gets her back blown out in the back of a lorry. Just want to say thank you for the continued support in this series. It's been awesome so far. We still haven't encountered what the hell is causing mischief at the camp, so hopefully we find out very, very soon. Anyway, let's get it. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Which way should we go? Why don't you choose? Oh, Shady Glade, Rocky Road. Uh, let's see, I'm looking at the actual photo while I'm lighting on the sign. Shady Glade is lit. Really well lit. Rocky Road is not. The Rocky Road could be bad. Shady Glade could be good. Uh, let's go for Shady Glade. Let's go this way. God, are you okay? I'll be okay. <laughs> Come on, I'll spot you. Love is in the air. Do, 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 do. Love is in the air. Are we gonna fuck in the woods? We're gonna fuck in the woods, aren't we? Here we are. So, um, I heard this joke about artists. It's pretty bad. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You want to hear it? Sure. Okay. Here it is. Why couldn't the world's fastest painter ever keep a girlfriend? Hmm, why not? Because he always finished in one stroke. It's dumb. Sorry, Jacob told me about it. Uh, isn't that about golfers? Because of the stroke thing? Yeah, sorry. I don't know. <laughs> Jacob probably heard it from his campers. That makes so much sense. Those kids have filthy minds. <laughs> Whoa. Just a bird. Just a bird. Oh, I'm... I'm so sorry, I've just been on a little... Just been a little edgy lately. Oh, bless ya. Eh, uh, curious or reassuring? I have one sounds nice. Why? It's probably nothing, but ever since the campers left, I've had this weird feeling that there's someone else out there. Like, watching us. Like... There is still campus here? No. No, it's you know, just the little hairs in the back of my neck standing up, you know? Yeah. Well, it's probably nothing. Right. You're right. On love, let's go make some sweet, sweet love. I, I don't even know if we need to explore around here or if we need to strictly walk over to the ledge or whatever it is over there. Eh. Come on, love. Let's go for a snuggle. Hey, actually, let's go back this way. I don't know if we can actually walk any quicker. There doesn't seem to be a designated button and when I hold anything down. Oh, wait there. Does that change it? Oh, okay. So, if you press and hold down L1 or... I think we're back near the path again. Oh, I know where we are. Yeah? Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. This 
view is just... Wow. Are you really good or do you me? Yeah, come on. Let's not put that jawline to waste. Ooh. Do me. Oh, sorry. I'm, I'm just trying to get this down. Right. Sorry. Dumb idea. I just want to finish this. Take your time. Well, I failed. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. Oh. Oh, look! It's so tiny. <laughs> My god, he's so cute. Hold on. Hold on. Save Abby. Nah, I think it's just gonna be cues. <laughs> oh shit. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing, tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. At least when it's safe. How do I know when it's safe? Is it safe? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh shit. Jeez. <laughs> oh, that was close. <laughs> he almost just mowed me to death. Imagine a story, or it's actually a ball. Eh, cheerful, keep it light. At least we gave her a good story to tell her pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? Mm, I got a pretty good look. Ew! I think she was coming on to me. Oh, got yourself a little girlfriend. Well, she wasn't that little. <laughs> No, kind of don't want this to be a horror game, no. Guess we should head back. Right, what do you got in store for us now? <sighs> Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick.
Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, let's zoom in. No? There's going to be something creepy that I find here, isn't there? Gotta be. Yeah, the sun looks kind of cool there, but... I like how the cabin looks. Hmm, what should I take a photo of? What do you reckon? I like that. Oh my god, that looks cool. That looks cool. Let's do that. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Still no service. Ah, uh, yeah. So, pretty boring. I wonder, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hag uh, hacking. Okay. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick! Just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Oh, I got pockets, quarry. You both okay? Yeah. I mean, they all look alright. Uh, are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. It wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Oh. Oh. Special delivery! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come uh, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and, we bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these... Are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Not leaving you with a gun or not a great idea? Uh, yeah, it's not a great idea. Okay, as much as I enjoy watching Nick squirm away from a challenge, I don't think this is a great idea. Hey, uh, you know what? Yeah, you're right. Maybe I should just uh, give Nick the Butter Pops as like an act of charity or something. Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! <laughs> <laughs> Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're going to act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not going to die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah. Guess we're going to have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good.
so, just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you'd actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes, got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she cuts all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, um, how's your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? How's things with Emma? It was okay. It, w it was okay, to be fair. It was... It was okay. Hey! Attaboy! So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah? Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 no. Hey, look. No sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obs. Oh, that's kind of cool. Actually handles pretty well. So I'm on the left here. Wait, I've got to shoot watermelons or bottles. Right, let's have a little go now. All right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay, good. All right, Nick. This time for real. How does that bottle not break before? Right, two bottles. Here we go. Let's go, bitch. Nice shot. And watermelon. Lucky. Oh, I wasn't lucky. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this fucking cannon dude, blaster. That is how you get someone shot. God. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Uh, good game or what pops theme? Ah, oh, I really want to go to him, but I don't want to annoy him. But pops, fuck it. Ooh, what's that, Jakey? Huh? Huh? Pop. Peanut butter, butter Okay, pops. I get it. I get it. Blam. You thought this was over? What the? Whoa. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. 